foundation Friday I'm sorry I have been gone I've been very very sick um, these past couple of weeks so I'm very 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 sorry that I have not filmed um, any videos here recently but here I am still have pneumonia second video of 2020 we're gonna do this we're gonna get straight into it I'm using two different primers today. That's why I am starting off completely bare face, no moisturizers, no nothing. Well, I do have a moisturizer on, but not a primer. The first one I want to talk about is the ColourPop. Pretty Fresh Hydrating Hyaluronic Acid Primer. And I will just take this one on my fingers. Put it on. Let me tell you what was going on with me. I had bronchitis first, then strep. Then flu A, or B, and then, we're just going to work this in with the figures. And then I had flu A, had a bit of a break, and then found out that I had pneumonia. But I am dedicated to you guys. And even though I feel like dog doo doo, I am here today making this video. Working it all the way into my skin. And wiping it on the pants, because, you know, why not? We're going to let that dry just a tad. It gives a nice, pretty glow to the skin, but today I want to use a um, more of a glowing primer than um, a pore-filling primer, which will be the Honest Beauty Everything Primer in Glow. Sorry, my dog's in the background are causing a ruckus. And just like with that one, we're going to take a little bit. I'm not going to take as much because this one is kind of tinted. Okay. Now we're going to rub this one in with our fingers as well. And it's a bit of a thicker formula than the color pop. Yes, I go over my lips. And then we're going to take a little bit on the forehead, like that. Just like that. And run it over the eyes. Down the neck a little bit. Sorry if I'm losing my voice. I haven't talked straight in like a few days. We're gonna put our headband on. Pull the ears out. Today for foundation. I'm not quite sure what which foundation I want to use today. I guess I should have figured that out before this video, shouldn't I? I feel like we should do a drugstore, because last week was not drugstore. So... We 
will do the CYO Long Lasting Foundation Life Proof in 101. I got this recommendation from Taylor Wynn. She is amazing at what she does. Amazing. And I, my heart goes out to her for having that surgery that she had. I can relate. I also suffer from migraines just like she does. But I'm sure mine aren't quite as bad as hers that require surgery. Sorry if my dogs are being too loud. Hush, Harper. And then we're going to take our nasty brush and just start working that into the skin. I go in circular motions. I don't go to ham. Oh, that time I did, I got an eyelash in my But I don't go ham ham with a brush. And I will pat it down with a dampened beauty blender at the end of the video. Or, not at the end, but. Towards the end of the makeup. Alright, that's on. Now I need to bring it down the neck. Let me just take a quick look at it. Okay, everything looks good. Um, I don't think I'll need to pat this one down with a, a beauty blender. It is blended out fairly well. Um, does anybody else get foundation lips and like it? Or is that just me? I don't know. But I will be right back with my finished makeup. Okay, here you have the finished look of the... I used the Going Coconuts by ColourPop palette um, and everything else I will list down in the description box. Um, my holy grail at the moment would be the Becca um, Gold Dust Highlighter. Highlighter. I use it all over my face and it makes everything so much better. It just makes you instantly glow everywhere. Anyway, I'll do a flash test and we'll do a wear test throughout the day. Anyways, I will see you in the next clip. This is what the makeup looks like in natural lighting. As you can see, it is very glowy, very um, golden-y, I guess you could say. Um, my eyes are a bronzy color, um, and you can tell that the foundation is sitting nicely all over my skin. But yeah, this is what it looks like in natural lighting. There is a little bit of flashback with this, but that's okay. But this is the flash test. This is my 4.30 o'clock check-in. And the makeup, I took a nap, is, and it's still holding up really well. The lipstick is staying on. I mean, everything is just staying in place. Hi guys, this is my last check-in for the night. It is nine o'clock. And I am ready to take this makeup off. It has been a very long day. But the makeup performed overall very well. I do recommend the CYO Long um, Life Proof Long Wear Foundation. Yes, they are discontinuing it. Don't know when. 
but they are. But for now, stock up. It's a really good foundation and it holds up throughout the day really nicely. Anyway, I will see y'all guys in my next video.